Hi, in this lesson, we're going to take a look at the taskbar notification area. And that's down here in the lower right corner of our screen. We have our taskbar, and this isn't really all that new. This has been around for a while, and you see that we have shortcuts to like OneDrive, Network, we have the Windows Inc. Workspace, our calendar. And if we click on this little arrow, we have some more hidden shortcuts here. But there's still a lot going on, and I want to show you what's really one of the newer things, and that is our notifications. And we're going to click here, and when we do, you see this opens up. We have this panel here, and this is where we're going to see notifications. And we can get notifications from apps, from Windows, from the Windows Store, notifications from all kinds of things, alarms if there's problems, security notifications, network notifications, just all kinds of stuff is going to show up here in your notifications area. Now, we have three in here, and you see that we can collapse them or expand them. You can delete them by clicking on the X. You can also decide what kind of notifications you get and when. So we're going to go up here, and we're going to click on Manage Notifications, and it's going to take us to the notifications area. And you can see here we have settings that will allow us to pick and choose which apps we get notifications from, which services, and where we want to see them. Do we want to see them on the lock screen? Do we want to see them if we have incoming VOIP calls? All kinds of settings here to help you with your notifications. But there's one more thing I want to show you, and that is the focused assist settings. And if I click here, you'll see that the focus assist allows you to select when you're going to see the notifications. Right now, it's off. So we're going to get all notifications all the time. We can set it for priority only. We can set it for alarms only. And there's more settings down here where you can limit or not which notifications you're going to see. And I showed you this because I want you to see, we're going to go back to our notification area and we're going to come down here. You see these four buttons. There's some shortcuts in here as well. But there's also this that says expand. And if I click there, I see a number of different shortcuts. And these are, again, to different features. And one of them is focused assist. Now, if these buttons are gray, that means they're off. Right now, the only one that's blue is location. Location services are on on this computer. Focus assist is off, which means all of our notifications can happen whenever. But if I click it one time, you see, it helps me set it to priority only. Click it again, alarms only. Click it again, it's off. And we have these buttons here for several other settings as well. We can get to our network settings, all settings. If we're using a VPN, nightlight, airplane mode, nearby sharing, Bluetooth. You can turn Bluetooth on and off right here. Project and my favorite, another one we're going to take a quick look at is tablet mode. If you're using a tablet, a Surface tablet, a Windows Surface tablet, in tablet mode, let's go ahead and let's click it. See what happens? This is tablet mode, and it makes it easier for you to physically, with your finger, touch these buttons, these tiles, to get to the apps. Start button over here. Click on that. Nothing comes up. Everything is what you see on the screen. And notice, even down here on our taskbar, there's a little bit more space between each of these icons. Again, making it easier for you to hit these buttons with your finger. And if you want to get out of tablet mode, you can simply come down here and turn it off. So now you know a little bit more about the taskbar notifications area here in Windows 10. But that's it for this lesson. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you next time.